Yo, yo, yo! What is going on, coaches? Happy, happy Wednesday. Hope you all are having an amazing, amazing week. Uh, I am so excited to jump in here today to share today's transmission. Uh, but first and foremost, if you are here live, uh, give me some love. Let me know you're here. If you are here on the replay, do the same. Let me know you're here because I'd love to come back and see what you guys are saying and how you're interacting with what I'm talking about because otherwise I'm just talking to a screen and that's not fun unless the screen talks back. And if the screen talks back, it means you have access to really good drugs. Really good drugs. Okay, really quickly, I'm just gonna check in and make sure this is working and also so I can see the uh, comments on my phone here since I won't be able to see them on the computer. And Remington Steele is in the house. Remy, my dog. What's up, bro? So good to see you, man. Uh, anyway, so hope you guys are having an amazing week. And, uh, and I'm really excited to share some of these lessons with you because I've been working with a, a new client recently. We just started working together. And he has, in the last seven days, uh, closed $32,000 in new coaching clients. And this is, uh, th this is three different clients, uh, two at a 10K rate for three months, uh, one at a 15K, sorry, 12K rate for three months, which if you do the math, 10, 10, 12, carry the one, divided by seven, put in the artist formerly known as Prince, little icon, uh, divided by pi, uh, then hit yourself in the face of the pi, it's 32K. Um, and so that's what he has been able to create in the last seven days. And so we just had uh, one of our, uh, we actually, it wasn't a call, we just had some back and forth. He's a private client, so he has back and forth, like WhatsApp access, well, Telegram access. And so we were talking back and forth about this, and, and we wanted to really, I wanted to be able to really decode what it was that he did that allowed him to be successful. Now, one thing I didn't even say, which I probably should have put in the title here, and actually I'll probably go back and put it in the title afterwards, is that he generated this 32K using almost no social media. Now, all of you know that, you know, the way I've built my business primarily has been through social media, or at least that's the way it looks. I would actually say the, the way I've built my business is through relationships, uh, but but some of that looks like relationship building online. But there's a misconception that um, fr from people that I've talked to before, before they've joined the program to work with us, or even before they've, they've come to work with me one-on-one, -on -one, is that I'm going to try to make them into a social media uh, expert. Um, I have no desire to do that, and there are plenty of ways to build your business. Businesses were around way before social media uh, was around, and they'll be around far after social media in its current form doesn't look the same anymore. So... This particular client who is a rock star, and I want to say ahead of time, like he's, he was already doing good, like he's not a brand new coach. Uh, but even though he's not a brand new coach, the lessons that I'm going to share with you today that were a big part of him being able to close this 32K in seven days are applicable to everybody, no matter what level you're at. In fact, what I've seen is that probably a lot of people who get to a level of success in coaching uh, were probably practicing the things that I'm about to share with you. And then at some point they stopped practicing those things and that's why they stopped having success or they had a, they had a limit of their success. Uh, if you're here live, let me know you're here live. Would love to hear from you. If you're here in the replay, send me some love, send me some hearts, throw in an eggplant emoji. I'm good with whatever. Uh, and just so I know that you're here and you are paying attention. So what I would love to know from you, again, whether you're live or on the replay is, would you like to know these three things that he did to be able to generate this 32K in seven days without using much social media? If so, drop a one in the comments here. And, and, and I want to tell you right now, this is something where... Um, it's something where if you if you really focus on this stuff and you and you focus on uh, if you really focus on what I'm saying here and don't discount it as being too simple or only working for somebody that's been around in the game longer, I want you to really really focus in that these things are applicable to you. Luann is in the house. Luann Stevens, Queen Luann, so good to see you here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Cool. Okay, so Luann is in in for it. She wants to hear it. We're not going to wait for anybody else right now. We're going to dive right in. But for everybody else that's here live uh, and on the replay, I love you and we're excited to dive in here. So. Let's talk about the three lessons that I got from this client that I want to share with you that I think will be really, really powerful for all of you. Number one, ABC. It's all I'm going to say. ABC. And ABC stands for always be connecting. Always be connecting. Now, one of the things I hear from people all the time, and I've heard this from clients, and I've said this myself when I started, for sure, but I hear this all the time from clients is, where do I find people to coach? Where do I find clients, right? And that's one of those questions that I've built an entire program on how to find clients. So it's not a question I can have even answer because it's, it's much bigger. It's not a thing that you do, a specific thing. It is an essence, it is a framework, and it is, it is a, a consistent practice. But one thing that's at the core of client creation is that you must always be connecting. Now, while people are saying, where do I find these people? Where do I find these people? This particular client said, you know what? I'm just going to focus on the people that are already in my world. 
So when I say he didn't use social media much, what I mean is that he wasn't doing a bunch of Facebook lives or LinkedIn lives or Instagram stories or, or posting on Facebook. He doesn't have a Facebook group. I don't even think he has an email list. But what he did was the people that are already in his world, he went in and deepened connection with them. He went in and was curious about what was going on in their world. And I hear so many people, I've heard so many people say this and, and, and lovingly, very lovingly, I'm going to say this is a sense of entitlement in what I'm about to say when people say this is they say, yeah, but I don't want to spend a bunch of time wasting a bunch of time talking to people that aren't going to be my clients. Well, listen, unless you have a full roster of clients, uh, what better way could there be for you to be building more relationships if we believe that coaching is a relationship game, what better thing could you be doing than just connecting with humans? Because even if that person is not someone who's gonna be a client for you, you don't know who's in their world. And by you being curious about them and allowing them to be curious about you, you may find synergies here. This is a big part of, of what we talk about in the, in the CPBI self-study program. Again, a lot of people think it's like a marketing social media thing. We're talking about how to deepen connections with people, right? Whether you do it online or offline, we're talking about how to deepen connection with people. And that's one of the beautiful things about having access to me in the live monthly calls uh, in the CPBI self-study VIP is that we, I can talk to you about specific language. And we're gonna actually talk about that in a second, but specific language of how to be in connection with these people in your world, how to get in their world, how to be curious in a way that, that allows you to move the conversation forward and I help you and teach you, develop, teach you to develop specific tools, uh, namely the three by three by three framework that we teach in the program that allows you to get into more purposeful conversations with people. So if you are not constantly or consistently, I should say, connecting with people, that's number one. Don't worry about going wide, go deep into the world of the people that are already with you. Don't worry about finding a bunch of new people. This person, this client that I'm talking about, these three people that he signed up, he had either met them before at an event or had limited communication with them or had met them several times at different events and he just stayed active in their world and, and stayed curious about their world and it was huge. Uh, Tanya's in the house, team money, what's going on? So happy you're catching me live as well. So that is number one, ABC, always be connecting. Number two, he increased his fees. I mean, that's a big way that he was able to hit uh, 32K in seven days. He increased his fees. After we had our first coaching session, he decided to double his rate after our first call. Not flippantly, not like, hey, I, you know, I want to be seen as a, a bigger, more important coach, so I'm going to raise my fees. No, it's because he knows the value that he can provide these people, right? We were talking through this, and he's very, very clear of the value he can provide these people. So he went from 5K for three months to 10K for three months. And then on the last person he signed up, he's like, I'm going to stretch a little more. And he went 12K for three months. That's how he got the 32K altogether. So he knew he wasn't in a place of uh, trying to rationalize or convince them, but instead he served them to the point that they saw that the benefit was there, right? They saw the benefit was there. So one of the things you want to do here is get really, really clear on knowing how you serve people. And the three by three by three model that we teach is a great way to do that. But also in conversation, make sure you're really listening to what's going on. Make sure you are getting masterful at your enrollment conversations, which is essentially what he's doing here when I say this. Um, Get masterful at your enrollment conversations so that you're really listening and seeing where your genius can be of most service to them. And if you're able to do that, it will truly increase the likelihood people will sign up even at higher fees. I also shared a tool with him that we teach in the CPBI self-study program, a pricing tool that is, we've had several people tell us that it is worth the entire price of the program, even when it was a 10K program. Uh, now it's obviously much less expensive than that. Uh, but when it was a 10K program, they said it was a game changer because this one simple tool that I teach in pillar one of the program will allow you to increase your fees while basically re removing any of the fear of doing so and using the tool in the way that I teach you to use it will actually increase the likelihood that people will sign up uh, at whatever fee that you want them to sign up at. Um, so it's a really amazing tool. And again, that's something we teach in the program, but getting really clear on your enrollment conversations and, and being really powerful there and listening so you know how you can serve people will allow you to increase your rates, which will of course allow you to make more money in your business and make more impact. Okay, so that's number two. Number three, and this is a huge one, a huge, huge, huge one. And this is one that 99% of business building programs will not even mention to you because it's not in the realm of traditional marketing, but it's one of the most powerful marketing tools you can have. And it's this, he focused on becoming a more powerful coach, right? He wanted to raise his fees, but he knew that he was going to have to really be able to powerfully serve these people to get that fee. Now, 
there are a few ways that you can shortcut the process of becoming a more powerful coach. Of course, practice is key. There's no books or videos or anything else that you can consume and you become a better coach. You have to take what you consume and actually go test it. But there are two main ways that, that I've seen and that I've used myself and that my clients have used, including this guy that, uh, that I'm talking about now, that will allow you to become a more powerful coach, which allows you to increase your fees, which allows you to have uh, uh, more people saying yes to your, your offer and making more money in your business, which allows you to have a sustainable business, which allows you to continue making impact in people's world. And so the two main ways to do this is number one, get a coach, right? Get a coach and bring your sessions and what's happening in your sessions with your prospective clients to them. That's what happened here. So one of the people he signed up for 10K during our last call, he said, you know, I don't, I don't know about this guy. Uh, you know, I know I can serve him powerfully, but these very specific things happened on the call. And he, I, I don't want to go into details because obviously it's confidential, but there are very specific things that happened on the call. And my client wasn't really sure where to go from there. He, he didn't see where he could go from there and didn't, didn't see that there was a real possibility this person was going to be a yes for coaching when they had their next enrollment conversation. That was their first or second one. They were going to have a third. And I very quickly saw something that I said, this is the thing you want to focus on. If you focus on this one thing that kind of happened in passing towards the end of the session, he will sign up. And he focused on that thing and the person signed up. So this is one of the benefits, of course, of having a coach. Again, that's one of the benefits of, of being in the CPBI self-study VIP is that you can bring those things into our monthly calls. And again, I can tell you exactly what I see so you can go back and, and more powerfully coach them. But that was a huge thing for him, him going all in on that one small insight. And that one small insight was not just something in the coaching conversation. It was something that came up during the enrollment conversation. And then based on our conversation, I had him respond to the person via email with one certain thing and then dive into that even deeper on their next call and then the person signed up but you wouldn't know to do that unless you had somebody who could reflect to you that's been further along the path to let you know hey as a master coach here's something that you may want to look at uh, that will help uh, help this person be moved forward and help them see possibilities that's the first way the second way you can do it is to uh to watch powerful coaching right to watch people actually being coached uh, and so in whatever way you do that, that's great. If you have access to, that, the access to that already, that's awesome. If you have like peer coaches in your world where you guys can share recordings with each other, of course, you want to make sure that's, that's okay before you're sharing recordings with each other. But if you do that and you can kind of pick out and, and see things that work or don't work and give each other feedback, that's awesome. One way that, that I allow people to do that is by being in our CPBI self-study program. You don't only get access to two years, nearly two years of sessions with me coaching people. So you can see exactly what I do and exactly how I approach things. But we also have a bonus in there where you get to see a bunch of real live coaching demonstrations from some of the best coaches on the planet. People that I brought together, interviewed them, had them do a live coaching demonstration. And then I went in and debriefed and pulled out all the nuggets of what they were doing in coaching to make it real for you. We have Steve Chandler, Rich Litvin, Sean Stevenson, uh, Christine Hassler, Christine, uh, Christina Berkeley, uh, um, uh, just amazing, amazing coaches in there. Uh, and we have demonstrations. We have, I think, 12 or 15 of those coaches, maybe even more, uh, with demonstrations demonstrations of their actual coaching. So these are the things that you really want to focus on. And I'm going I'm to revisit these real quick. Number one, always be connecting. Don't worry about getting into people that are brand new people. And, and that's fine to work on brand new people as well. But look at going deep in the people that are already in your world instead of already always looking for new people. So number one, always be connecting. Number two, Increase your fees, but increase your fees by knowing and being really clear on how you can serve these people and having the right uh, tools that you need to be able to state your fee confidently, uh, to be able to increase the likelihood people will sign up and to have tools at your disposal to help people see the value of your coaching. Uh, and then number three is focus on becoming a more powerful coach. Uh, if you're gonna, if you want to raise your fees, if you want to get more referrals, if you want to uh, have more sustainable business, especially with one-on-one -on -one stuff, you're gonna need to really blow people's socks off and, and really facilitate transformation in their world. So, a couple ways to do that, as I mentioned, um, you can uh, get a coach, so you can bring your sessions to your coach and get feedback on how you can be more powerful in those sessions, uh, or you can do something like joining the CPBI Self Study VIP, where you get access to all these videos of all these amazing coaches that are coaching. Uh, as well as uh, being able to see almost two years of coaching calls uh, from me. And I'll give you a quick little thing. And I'd love to know which one of those three really resonated with you the most. Which one do you think would make the biggest impact for you? Uh, do you think it's number one? Or are you maybe not connecting as much as you could be? Uh, is it number two that you haven't, your fees are a little low and maybe you're not clear on how you serve people powerfully to be able to raise those fees? Or maybe you're not sure how to raise those fees because it feels scary? Uh, or is it number three that you feel like you need to become a more powerful coach and be able to serve people more deeply? Whichever one it is, it could be all three. Yeah, Nick says all three of these are are, 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 are okay, uh, a okay. 
love it. Thanks, brother. Uh, Tamara says, uh, yay, I'm catching this live, late but live. Better late than never, my dear. Um, so yeah, I'd love to know from you guys, one, two, or three, or it could be multiples, it could be all three. Uh, let me know, I'd love to know. And then, like I mentioned, uh, what we do have here, and I realize I just, I really don't share this stuff with you guys enough, but uh, if you wanted to get this kind of support and learn all these things, get access to the exact same things that my private client is getting access to that I was telling you guys about, you can join us in the CPBI. And the CPBI used to be, for a lot of you that have been around here for a while, used to be a, between an eight to 10K program. Now it's less than $1,500. Uh, it used to be eight to 10K for six months. Now it's $1,500 for a year. And you get access to all the exact same content that teaches you all you need to know about sales and enrollment and building your model. And it teaches you about social media stuff. And it teaches you how to connect with people more deeply. And it teaches you all the things you need to know to, to grow your business, all the things that I've done. We've had hundreds and hundreds of people go through this. But then some of the bonuses you get here is like I mentioned, we have the call recordings vault. So not only do you have all of these, uh, I'm sorry, let me go back here for a second. Uh, not only do you have, sorry, these are going a little bit slow today. There we go. Uh, so you have, when you get in here, this is, you'll have a link in here. This is the link for the monthly live calls. We have one coming up in, in another week and a half. So if you sign up before then, you'll get access to the next live call. So we have recordings of all the live calls in this program, but also we have all of these recordings of literally nearly two years of group coaching calls from me, also group coaching calls from Brian on my team that he's coaching people around sales stuff specifically, and recordings of Tanya coaching people around creating really epic content in the content clinic. All that stuff is available to you as a VIP member. And for the calls with me, which is really cool, you can actually track down calls by topic. So if you click on this, you'll actually see in here that we have a searchable vault. And when you click on the vault, it's gonna open up this Google doc right here, which is awesome. Uh, Nick says, I made 10K last month and using a lot of what I learned from Jason. Definitely dive in if you're considering it. Thank you, Nick, and congrats, man. That's amazing. Freaking love that, 5K month. Well done, brother. Love, love, love that. Uh, let's see, yeah, Narelle says two years of coaching. And that's great, like two years of coaching is amazing. And there are still things that, people that have been in the game longer, I've been coaching for nearly 10 years. There are things that I see that people even a few years into the game don't necessarily see yet. And so having somebody you can bring that stuff to, like I said, this client that I have, he's been coaching for a couple of years, but what I showed him with what he brought to me, he said, oh my gosh, I would have never thought to go there. And that was what pushed the person over the edge to see what was possible. Luann says, all of them totally get that. Uh, Tamara says, I think the connection part, I have people in my life right now. Exactly. So when you go in here, you have this vault and there's all these different uh, categories of things that will be for your business and also for your mindset. So if we go to this one, for example, and we click on the mindset and productivity tips, you'll see all these different things that we focus on. So let's see, here's one, uh, what to do when self-talk and patterns of I can't make it happen start showing up, reframing our relationship to the online space and what we are actually doing when creating content as well as having a lower price offering for people who can't afford your one-on-one -on -one coaching. So if you wanna get all that, if you wanna see me coaching somebody around all that, you just click the little link here it's gonna take you directly to the actual coaching call and you'll see here on the vault it said at 510, which means all you need to do in this video is fast forward to five minute and 10 second mark and you will see program, me coaching somebody live on this exact topic. And they've all given us permission to do this. They are amazing. Uh, they are people who are part of the original CPBI. So anybody you see getting coached, they gave us explicit permission to do so. So we're not doing this behind their back at all. Um, the other thing you get access to that I mentioned was that you also get access to, let me just go back here. Uh, you also get access to, ba, 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 ba. actually, did I already close that maybe? Well, what I was going to show you was, actually, I can show you. Oh, it's over here. I got it. Okay. So then you also have this bonus content. So besides having 60 of these little videos that are like four or five minutes, and they're just little kind of espresso shots for your, uh, for your day to get you pumped and ready to go in your business, you have these master coaching demonstrations. So you see Steve Chandler, Rich Lithvin, John Morgan, Melissa Ford, Christine Hassler, just all these amazing people that you see live coaching demonstrations, There's probably 20 or so. And when you go into any one of those, you'll be able to see uh, what they coached on. So this was Rich coaching somebody, uh, coaching their clients to tap into their intuition and you see it's a two hour session because there's me interviewing rich then rich does the live session uh, and then we come back at the end and we debrief what it was he did so i can pull out all the nuggets for you so that is all of the stuff that is on offer uh in the uh cpbi VIP uh, self-study program. Again, we've made this as affordable as possible. If you know somebody in your world who could benefit from this, let them know. And I'm gonna go ahead and put, uh, I will put in the comments, or actually I'll put, uh, I'll put, uh, actually, do I have it here? I might even have it. I might, I might, I might. I don't, okay, that's fine. Um, so the, uh, the website is becompetitionproof.com slash 
SS for self-study. I'll put that in the, uh, in the comments. Or if you can't find it or having issues, just private message me and I can send you the details. Or if you have questions, private message me and I can send you details. Uh, Jason, uh, Susan says, Jason, is that in our vaults too, the coaches coaching others? No, that is a bonus thing that's just for the, uh, the VIP program uh, based on I'm only able to use it for certain things. That's, that's where I'm able to use it. So, uh, so no, Susan, that part is not, uh, not available uh, for original CPBI people as of now. Uh, so anyways, that's all I got for you. Hope this was helpful for all of you. Please practice those three things, whether you do it with us or not. And if you want support to be able to do it at a masterful level and get direct access to me, you know where to find me. Come join us in the VIP. Lots of love, guys. See you soon. Peace.